my name is Paul Toronto. I'm a graduate of the Rodre Sonner School of Hotel and Restaurant Management at Newbury College. And today we're going to make guacamole. Guacamole is a great home snack. It's a lot less expensive to make this at home as well. So we're going to take three avocados. We're going to cut them in half. Well, not really cut them in half, but just go around that floor. Open your avocado. This is what you want. A little bit of, a little bit of, a little bit soft and ripe. Scoop the avocado with a spoon right around the skin and into the bowl. And then you have the core, and this is where it gets dangerous. Knife into the core, the core comes out again, right back into the bowl. Usually, when I'm at home, one avocado or two avocados will easily feed three or four people, depending on how much you like ball. So, again, right around the core, open the avocado, spoon it out, put it into the bowl. Core, this is a perfect avocado, very right. This is a great snack. So, with that, we have the typical ingredients, the lime. I think the key to the uh, guacamole is to zest some lime, not just juice it. So this is a microplane. This takes off the outside of citrus. And really gives that extra zing to the avocado. So we're gonna go right along, and you can see how it's just getting down to the pit. We're just pulling off the real green outer skin. And this is what I believe makes it. So these are about $15, great investment. So we'll take the lime and we'll squeeze it. My hands are clean, so I'm going to go right through my fingers. Juice one lime. I'm going to put everything in the bowl, and then we're going to mash it up with a fork. Get some rust. Wipe my hands. Then we have some plum tomatoes, or actually, I have some tomatoes in the vine. Either one works well. Whatever's more ripe. I'm just going to take the tomato. This is this is for the home, so I'm not going to waste even the seeds. I'm going to put it all in. Just pull off the top. I don't waste any of these tops. I use them for stock. Or if we, if we gather a lot of them at the restaurant, I'll puree them and make a little bit of a sauce. Puree and strain it. So we'll just leave the skin right on the tomato. See, my knife is very sharp, so it goes right through that skin of the tomato. It's also the key. It shouldn't be, you know, butchering the skin as you go. Tomato. A little bit of jalapeno that I've diced. A little red jalapeno. You can use green. This is where you can add whatever you like. This is the basic one. I'm going to add a little bit more red onion. So to dice the onion, again, flat surface. This is a half of a red onion. Cut the tip off. Then we're going to go in. Again, sharp knife. A couple slices in. You want a small dice. Then we'll go down. We're going to leave that little um, end on. Another tablespoon or so. Into the bowl, a little bit of pepper. I use black pepper. A decent amount of salt, because the avocados love salt. And then we're just going to go ahead and mash it up. You can see the fork does a nice job because the avocados nice and ripe. If you have a problem, it means you didn't use the ripe avocados. So just mix it around. Looks like guacamole. And this is when you could add your grilled shrimp, your lobster, Whatever you like. And there, mix it all together. And that's about it. Simple guacamole. 